Hey, how's it going, folks? My name is Rojo, and welcome back to Starcrawlers. Last time we did a random mission for Agri, uh, Agrigen, I believe is their name. And in fact, we can look at our standing with all of the different um, or corporations, I suppose, or organizations right here. So we are neutral with them, I guess, as this goes up. I'm not sure if we'll get like a new bar where it's like, you know, wow rep or something like that, where we have to get to 100, and that gets us to friendly, and then friendly is like, you know, we gotta get to 300, and then that gets us to etc, etc. Or if it's just all done in this 1 to 100 scale, we can take a look here too. Ah yes, we were supposed to possibly return some medical supplies, or deliver some medical supplies to these guys instead of Chimera, but uh, we didn't. And we can also try to contact these uh, various organizations, but we're not going to worry about that right now. Last time we did, in fact, also get ourselves a new crawler. And this is a special kind of character, the prototype. He is a robot, that uh, the one that we defeated in episode 2, in fact. And uh, he's been repainted and given a little bit of a, uh, a personality overhaul, so he's on our team now. Now, uh... We'll do all of his abilities in a separate intro. For now, all we need to know is that we're going to give him Arm Cannon, which uh, is a fairly powerful attack. But uh, the reason that we're going down this tree is because he's uh, going to sort of be our healer temporarily. I'm not sure if we're going to stick with the prototype long term, but uh, we will at least try him out for a, a, a mission or two or for a little while. We'll, we'll see how things go, I guess. But uh, yeah, we can give him this Haiku.exe ability, which will uh, probably inspire the team for five turns. I don't know what that means exactly, but more importantly, it will uh, give allies regeneration, so they heal at, at the uh, start of their turn for 3% of their max HP. Um, so yeah, that's a very uh, useful ability. It doesn't take very many time units, as you can see as well. It only takes 25% uh, weapon speed, so... He could do this and then do something else in a very short amount of time. Um, yeah, so that's what we're going to give him. He does use his own stuff, I guess. Uh, we have more ability points to spend, excuse me. Okay, yeah, right, right, right. I uh, forgot that we had leveled up on uh, Jekyll here as well. Uh, we're just going to get Whispers for now. And um, that'll make it so it can't miss or be dodged or anything, which is pretty good. And uh, now we will select a new mission. I want everybody to be... Oh, this one actually, I guess it doesn't change. Uh, regardless, I still want us to be level 3. Uh, before we do this mission, level 3 on everybody. So we're going to do another random mission here. We could escort an engineer. Who is this that we're doing the mission for? Aurora. Which is neither of these other companies. Okay. Data, more data recovery, or no, we got, we did asset recovery last time. None of these look too crazy to me. I don't know, we could, uh, we could try this one. It's the best paying at the moment. It looks like we, we just have to protect an engineer. So I've done a mission like this before, uh, and we actually get an extra guy on our team, which makes it possibly even easier. Well, this is level four, and a lot of our guys are level two. I take it back. Yeah, we should probably probably hold off on that. So we can get four high explosive power cells. We could get two. We could activate two beacons, or we could protect the scientists while they download data from a terminal. Kind of a similar type of mission. Why don't we uh, go with this? We'll probably put a hacker on our squad. And uh, oh. We should heal. <laughs> Forgot all about that. And we need to sell some stuff too. So, uh, uh, medical attention. Let's see how much this is going to cost us. Oh, and we have uh, various addictions and stuff on her as well. Permanent until cured. Permanent until cured. Oh my god, this is expensive. I have an idea for that. Uh, for, for now, let's just get our HP back. On everybody who uh, who needs it, everybody has radiation sickness. Oh wow! Damage taken increased ten percent. That's pretty bad. 
What I'm wondering is if she has any uh, healing items herself, or maybe, I guess actually he would be the one who has them. Because there's, uh, there's a couple drugs that will cure status effects, and they might be cheaper than having this guy do it. <laughs> uh, it's kind of what I was hoping anyway. But anyway, uh, give me a moment so I can sell some stuff, and then we will do uh, that mission. All right, our inventory is pretty well cleared out, and uh, I put these two biomass bolus thingies in our uh, our stash because it says unique item. I'm not really sure what they're for, so maybe we'll find a use for them later on. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, do this data recovery mission, shall we? Everybody's in pretty good shape, aside from the radiation sickness and the you know chem addiction and all that. But uh, we'll get people healed up when we can. All right, regular scientist, I'll need to download the data from one secure terminal. I'm not sure of the coordinates or what kind of resistance we'll encounter, but that's where you come in. I'm not bad in a fight. I'll do my best to help out. If there's trouble, I'm ready to go when you are. Well, there might be trouble basically immediately here because uh, there's some asshole security cameras right here. This is worth like almost nothing, but I will take it nonetheless. What's this guy's deal? I wish we could just blow these damn oh blow these damn cameras up. <laughs> just gonna try to get out of this room ASAP. Well, we found <laughs> found combat. Speaking of combat, uh, I've actually increased the combat and animation speed uh, in the options, so these should probably end up going a fair bit faster. In the, uh, in the future. I used the wrong ability there, I think, but that's okay. Alright, prototypes, time to shine here. He actually does do a haiku, so there you go. <laughs> that is different every time. I'm not gonna read them, but you're certainly welcome to pause the video and read them if you choose to. But yeah, we're going to charge up that arm cannon, do some drain action, what else we got? Just, we just shoot him mostly to death now. But yeah, the uh, the extra healing is going to be very important for us, I think, as we kind of do harder and harder runs here. There's the arm cannon. Pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. The scientist helping out a little bit. I'm not sure what he's equipped with, but I think we can actually change his equipment if we want to. Yeah, these guys are so close to leveling up. It's a shame they didn't get uh, get leveled up last time. Some credits just on the floor here, though. Is there a booze stash? We got some hooch. <laughs> All right. Rigos. Oh, these guys. Uh, they make make fear, I guess. So I guess that would make sense. Wow, the rare double miss, huh? Now, uh, one interesting thing about the prototype is that basically every one of his abilities has a chance to malfunction. And when he malfunctions, mm, bad things could happen, potentially. I'm not really sure <laughs> exactly what the consequences are. I haven't seen it happen yet. So uh, we'll want to keep an eye out for that, for sure. Definitely feels like these battles are going a lot faster, though, so that is nice. And we did level up, so you should be able to get that so Boldy can taunt now. And you get this, which gives us, well, a 20 extra percent chance to, uh, to crit, I think. And it deals uh, an extra 10% damage. 
Uh, shoot first, that is. Oh. Got our first actual security guy, huh? Oh, we can actually do madness with only 35 void energy now too, which is uh, which is nice. Not that it made a big impact here. He's one of the. These actually might be one of the terminals we're looking for. <laughs> we found the location of one of the terminals we're looking for. Oh, where could it be? All right, go for it, scientist. So that's it. The mission's over. If we want it to be, but we might as well keep exploring this area and uh, just see if we can get anything else. We do probably want some money to uh, try and try and get ourselves cured and all that kind of good stuff. The other thing is that uh, the scientist potentially could absorb some some hits for us too. It's like extra HP. We don't have to worry about healing for next time. Uh oh. <laughs> I didn't see quite what he said, murder about pro tip. Something about words. I'm not sure if that was a malfunction or what. Some heavy armor there. We could actually give that possibly to I think he, I was gonna say, yeah, this guy can use heavy armor and, and heavy weapons, which is interesting to me. I think we'll give him that for now. There goes Bolty. see another heavy pistol at some point here. Is that more booze? That's more booze. We'll take it. And who's leaving all their goddamn credits everywhere? I think this is some kind of crafting item. We'll definitely take it. We don't have a soldier on our squad, so I don't know if we'll ever have the opportunity to, uh, use that, but uh, you never know. Same thing there, I suppose. Hmm. Let's take a closer look, shall we? It's got some risque photographs, I think it said. Let's see, we've got uh, an unregistered com link. Let's see, opening the most recent conversation thread and skimming its contents, you quickly ascertain that these materials are the subject of an extortion scheme. Sender's demand was 300 credits to keep the photos and videos private. Investigate both parties. Uh, the conversation itself is heavily encrypted, but the comlink's owner clearly didn't exercise the same care in blocking access to the device's stored information. 
uh, you were able to determine that all the pertinent information of both sender and recipient uh, without much difficulty. Uh, I see. Uh, try to store 500 credits, take the photos. Mm, let's take the photos. Maybe we can sell those ourselves for more money. We'll see. Oh, wow. Well. I was not expecting that guy. Okay, let's uh, grab the shields and get the. Oh, these guys have shields too. Forgot about that. All right, let's see here. I think the strafe is fine. Oh, never mind. <laughs> There, I think we did. Um, hmm. Yeah, I think the one catch with the arm cannon though is that if we do use it, we have to, uh, we have, or like if we start charging it, we have to use it on the next turn or, or else we'll, uh, we'll lose the charge. What is this thing? A key card. That's interesting. Hmm. We have made a terrible mistake. <laughs> the alarm is now very much active uh, in a big way. Not sure if that means we're going to get a bunch of random encounters or what that means. overloaded a little bit there, that's fine. <laughs> Probably should have just used madness, actually, we had enough. Good stuff. Awesome, we just got in here. Fine spirits, I'm only award. We could auction this off. Let's, uh, let's not worry about that for this particular mission. That is not working. So we'll just move on here. Maybe we should have used our key card on this door instead. I don't know. Or this door. <laughs> Guess our key card only works on one door, huh? Wow. Seeing a lot of double misses. Very distressing. Love that arm cannon, it does so much damage, even though it takes two turns to charge. I think uh, we could use this heavy shield. May as well. Oh, another guard, huh? Probably didn't need to uh, charge the arm cannon there now that I'm looking at this guy's HP. <laughs> That's okay. 
Oh, that's pretty nice. I think we probably should have done a haiku with uh, the prototype, just because she's pretty beat up as usual. We will eventually be able to get a... Um, actually got some rum instead of hooch this time. Uh, we will eventually be able to give him a taunt, which is kind of interesting. And telephone canister is actually nice too, because that is a uh, an XP item. It's just a closet, huh? There's a Raikou. <laughs> oh, didn't mean to uh, do the heal. <laughs> I think uh, Bolty probably doesn't really need that right now, but that's okay, I suppose. Good stuff. And you aren't quite dead. Not quite. Almost. Definitely take that. What's this? Another Intellifoam canister? That's awesome. And we definitely want this cube. Oh, that doesn't look good. That really doesn't look good. <laughs> What's this? Fine Spirits Chromium Shipment! Oh, Alright, this is gonna hurt our rep with uh, Rigos, but uh, we're taking it. I'm not sure by how much. We'll find out, I guess, when we're done here. We're we're only going to get plus two rep for doing this job in the first place. Excellent. These combats are getting super easy. Which I am expecting will not be the case forever. Oh god, it's the fucking asshole radiation thing. Get out of here. Now now the prototype probably has radiation sickness too. Um You know what? We're already going down the shitter with these guys. Let's just keep on going. Wait, where does this go? Mission is complete. Do we want to return to sticks? Uh, you know what? Now is as good a time as any, I guess. Let's just get out of here. Cure all status effects. 200. Sure. Curious if it's going to say the prototype is also cured. Hey, we got rid of... That, that's actually like a deal. I don't think the prototype can get radiation sickness, which uh, honestly make kind of makes sense to me. Let's take a look at the wire here. Oh man, they did not like that. <laughs> I guess I don't blame them. Let's uh, just come down here and sell some of our stuff. We have some risque photos. Well, we can sell it anonymously for 100 credits, so that's something. Man. Rigos is not going to like us, but we can get a bunch of credits for this thing. Or we can sell it anonymously. See, the thing is, we're already in so deep that, like, not getting the extra credits seems like a waste of getting the negative rep. So 
So I think I'm going to go and uh, I'm going to get this uh, blue armor, as well as the credits. We're getting an extra rep with other corporations anyway. So it actually gives us plus eight rep. Or we could get a blue heavy shield. Let's do it. And there you go, that's it. So, uh, yeah, they don't like us very much. We probably won't be getting too much work from, from them in the future, if I had to guess. But we'll we'll see. Uh, anyway, till next time, my name has been Rojo, and thanks for watching.